forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal facing Everton. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. And dispossessed. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Abdoulaye Dukure plays alongside Alan in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Keane Alan Calvert Lewin good use of the ball but can they trouble the defence Calvert Lewin Arsenal have possession again Kessia Saka it's with Erdogan Nketia well that's the kind of player you want from your defender Alan and a poor ball Alan Richarlison it will be now excellent passing Everton moving the ball forward with purpose oh really sound goalkeeping well that's such a good save isn't it how did he keep that one out Can someone get on the end of this? The chance is on. And able to close down the shot. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? Now sending it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Richarlison. Andy Tuffin. That's Andy Tuffin. Options in the middle. Turning inside. Where's he going to go? And a no nonsense clearance. Could be threatening. A goal! 1 0. A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Good-looking sequence. Martin Odegaard. High pressing at its best. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Ducure. Could cross it in here. Well, he's let the ball run over the byline, and it's going to be a goal kick. <laughs> a 
and waiting for teammates to arrive on the scene. Calvert Lewin. He will be. Richarlison. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Intelligent threaded pass here. And Kessia. And Arsenal unable to retain possession. Well, here we are, moving close to half-time, and Arsenal chasing the game. Stuart, what have you made of their performance to this point? Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they haven't shown enough creativity, particularly in midfield, where there's been too many negative passes. If they can get the ball into the front areas that little bit quicker, I think they'll get back into this. Given away again. Everton moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Bukayo Saka. The cross is on. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Well, it was a close call, but the fans are not happy with that decision. Counter-attacking very much an option. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Seem to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. And using his strength to shield the ball. A very timely interception. Granite Jacker. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Now well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Alan. And so it is, the first half story has been written. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant... Back underway with Arsenal trying to find a route back into the match. Tavares. Granite Jacker. It's with Erdogan. Lokonga. Martin Erdogan on possibilities inside the box. This could be the equaliser. And the challenge, crisp and clean. Richarlison. Alan, hanging on to the ball in this fashion, suits them. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And it might be... Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. And a substitution in the offing. So 2-0 now. Substitution for Everton. Coming off the pitch, number 17, Alex Iwobi. Coming onto the pitch, number 30, Donny Gabriel. Lokonga. Bukayo Saka. Well, he's lost the ball. 
Well, the stats don't lie. Everton have had a lot of possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Nketiah. And he's fired it against the post. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. Oh, in with a chance. Alan. Not the pass he had in mind. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Martin Erdegaard. Xhaka. And possibilities here. Corner awarded to Arsenal. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. Who can he pick out? And he's clear as lines. Well, behind for another corner. And over comes the corner. Not all that convincing defensively. Martin Erdegaard regained possession. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they take advantage of the situation? <laughs> well, he's let the ball run over the byline, and it's going to be a goal kick. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance, and he's not finished just yet. to the final 20 minutes Martin Odegaard and Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position oh blocked it Let's see about the delivery. Well, not the best clearance. Lacazette. Well, possibilities inside the box. Chance to make a game of it here. Pivotal moment defensively. And Lacazette. Oh, good vision. Well, he had just gone beyond the last defender, Stuart. Well, that's a real shame because the through ball is really well weighted, but he just took too long to play it. And dispossessed. Xhaka. Lacazette. In search of space. Well, here we can see it again, and no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger, otherwise that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively.
And time for the change now. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Good looking sequence. Very quick thinking there. White. El Nenny. On to Pepe. Time and the scoreline against Arsenal. But still they're in this. But they dealt with the threat posed. Well, nearing the end of the game and Arsenal with work to do you've got to say Stuart well if they want to get something from this game they need to start getting the ball into the box that little bit quicker and get players attacking the ball otherwise this game will just slip away from them Calvert-Lewin Calvert-Lewin strong but fair tackle Saka well this is building up to a nail-biting finish these Arsenal fans are making so much noise can they get the equaliser here they're getting it forward but they need an equaliser can they get in behind them this could level it and all square now and you have to ask the question is the time for either side to win it well here it is again and the defending simply isn't good enough they have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. So the ball is running again at 2 all. And the referee blows the whistle. Still all square at the end of 90 minutes.